Hello and welcome to the Gamer Hobbit. Today we are covering the Tech Guns mod by Pwned1337. Tech Guns is a survival based tech mod, adding in new machines, weapons, armor, mobs, and more to your world. Before you take on what this mod has to offer, you should first craft the machines that are added. This mod categorizes the machines into three types. The simple machines are machines which do not require any sort of power and can be used on the get go. The single block machines, which require forge energy to power and allows you to create the essentials this mod offers. In case you are unaware, forge energy is essentially a power source, like RF, but merged into forge, so most mods that add or generate RF will be compatible with forge energy, such as redstone flux. Additionally, the machines also require transport to get to the machines, which can be done through either pipes from Buildcraft, conduits from Endo.io, or immersive engineering's wires. And finally, the multi-block machines require numerous blocks to be placed in a layout to form one large machine. Also requiring forge energy, these machines are used more for the late game, as they are more expensive. Most of these machines can set you up for creating ammunition, weapons, and stronger armor to protect yourself with, alongside creating vanilla items like gunpowder, and provide some customization options for the player. Each of these machines can also be upgraded by crafting machine upgrades. These upgrades are stackable and must be placed in the bottom right corner of the machine's GUI to upgrade. These upgrades can lead to more outputs created, hold more power, and can perform multiple operations simultaneously. Before we move on to the armor and weapons, Tech Guns implements a damage type system in which armor and weapons deal and receive different types of damage, ranging from radiation, lightning, and other elemental types of damage. Having this makes the game more challenging as you can no longer kill mobs with the same weapon over and over again. Effectively, at least. Tech Guns adds in 12 new sets of armor for you to collect, with each of those armor sets being split into two categories, underpowered and powered. Underpowered armor are sets which always work, like the vanilla armor sets, which can be repaired at the repair bench. The powered armor are sets which only work when powered up beforehand. Power can come from either steam or from RF. The chest piece must be powered for any of the other pieces of gear to work properly. So don't go running into a place guns blazing when you don't have the powered chest, otherwise it might not end well. Unlike other armor mods, tech guns armors don't break when they reach zero durability. Instead, once they hit one, they lose all of their stats and no longer provide armor, but they don't break, which could either be annoying or beneficial to you. Alongside the added armor, tech guns adds in various types of weapons to use in combat, ranging from alien blasters to scorching nether blasters. Each of these weapons all have unique models and special firing textures, which require different types of ammunition depending on how strong they are and how early they are crafted out. Additionally, some weapons have a secondary fire or mode to toggle, which can be done by either pressing or holding the right mouse button. This can range from zooming on weapons to charging up a more destructive blast and unleashing it against your foes. Tech Guns also adds in new mobs and structures, which you find across your world. These mobs can spawn in various places, ranging with the cyber demons in the nether to the alien bugs spawning in underground networks. The structures that are added spawn relatively frequent, particularly in the plains biomes, with some of the larger structures, such as the battleship, spawning less frequent but holding more enemies and better loot. Tackling some of the structures can be done around the mid-game, whilst others should be phased when you have stronger and better equipment. Tech Guns also include several other smaller features, including gore, unique dismemberment effects, which is influenced on the type of elemental damage you use to kill that mob, and turrets. These turrets can prove a valuable asset in defending your territory from dangerous mobs or from players. Like with the machines, turrets need a source of power for it to operate, and can be outfitted with any weapon from this mod, even chainsaw turrets. Their range and attack damage is based on what type of weapon they are equipped with, so a turret with a shotgun will only attack within 12 blocks, whilst the sniper will pick off their targets three times the distance. When crafted, the turret will have a base health of 30, but can be increased by creating armor upgrades for them. The more expensive the armor requires, the stronger it is. If there was a feature in which you did not want, or if you want to alter it, then the mod includes a config for you to do that. Overall, Tech Guns is a great combat mod with a survival tech based twist to it, and instead of adding in some new weapons and armor, it does a great job of making this world become more dangerous and providing several options to protect yourselves with through the end game of Minecraft. Thanks to Pwned1337 for making this awesome mod, and link to download it and additional mods used in the video are in the description below. And that is the end of the video. If you would like to see a mod showcased on the channel, then drop a comment and suggest it. 
and maybe it will be showcased in a future video. Hope you enjoyed the video, thank you for watching and have a good day.